Who was I with? Lucky, what are you accusing me of? You snuck off with Patrick again, didn't you? I have told you over and over in every way I know how I am not interested in Patrick Drake. And I am not sneaking around with him. And every time I turn around, you're with the guy. That's because I work as a private nurse for one of his patients. I'm bringing a little extra money for this family, and you know that, Lucky. And you know the reason I didn't tell you is because I didn't want to upset you. Obviously, it's in the opposite. So go ahead. You believe whatever you want because I am sick and tired of defending myself for something I didn't do. The, um, letters in 1027 need to be changed. Can you send someone to take care of that? 1027 can wait. Dr. Drake is in consultation and he needs his privacy. What's this about Patrick Drake needing his privacy? That's why they call it privacy. But in case you're wondering, he hasn't been anywhere near your wife tonight. Mm, thank you. Hi. I am so glad you called. I am so in the mood for another girl's night out. Oh, Lainey, I'm so sorry. Um, I should have explained. I need professional advice. Oh. No. No, I know. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, why didn't you ask me at the office? No, because, um, it's about Sunny. Oh, okay. And you didn't want him to find out? Right, right. Um, either he's being impulsive or I'm overreacting, and I just need you to tell me which. I read the pamphlet that you gave me, and some of it directly applies to Sunny, but it's just not that cut and dry. Okay, so what are you concerned about? Um, the mood swings. Mm-hmm. His son is getting more impulsive. For example? He bought a Maserati. Right, a Maserati, lady, and he barely even drives. And then last night I found him in the garden. He was, he was digging it up frantically in his business suit in the middle of the night. Mm -hmm. Have you discussed it with him? Yeah, he realizes that he's being erratic. Mm -hmm. um, he says it's because his life is just upside down because of this disagreement with Jason, which makes sense. Sonny lost his business, mm -hmm. which is like losing a part of himself. Of course he's going to have a reaction, but he's just been so volatile and inconsistent. And honestly, I think that you do have something to be concerned about. But unless Sonny wants to talk about it with you, I'm not sure what you can do. Oh, you must have read my mind. This is just what the doctor ordered. Come on, girls, you know the drill? Lick it, slam it, suck it. Pull up a chair, we're just getting started. Do you mind if we take it a little easier this time? Last time the headache was a killer. Mm. I remember, I don't remember what I said that night. Oh, yeah, Sunny won't let me forget what I said. <laughs> oh, that's right, something about wanting to, um... Oh, yeah, that was very oh, short oh, sure to the no, point. No, 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 seriously, you guys, I'm never gonna live that one down. The other night, Sunny and I were getting romantic, and I said, let's make love, and he said, are you sure you don't want to bang me? <gasps> oh, <laughs> seriously, stop nice. me before I get to that point, will you? Seriously. Maybe. Okay, all right, all right, so the forecast is calling for a low to moderate ASOC. Altered state of consciousness. Yep. By the way, are we all here because of men again? Yep. You got oh. it. Are we, uh, are we having fun yet, girl? Uh, get away. Wow. You're one of them. No, no, wait, wait. We can use him for our purposes. That's right. Mm. That's right. Cool, man. We What's need that? some more salt. Mm. Oh, you wish. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that. I like there you that. Go, that's it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so, Miss Emily, mm -hmm. how is Sunny? Um, complicated. Hmm. Well, at least he already has a bad reputation. What do you mean? Well, you expect him to be moody and difficult, so when he treats you well, it's a pleasant surprise. Your life would be easier with a good-natured guy like Lucky, right? <laughs> Let me tell you what happens when you're married to the man of your dreams. Picture a perfect couple, the envy of all your friends. Your husband doesn't trust you. That's not true. Well, Lucky knows you would never fool around with him. Guess who's the latest notch in Patrick Drake's set this week? The supply closet? Really? The supply closet? I opened the door and there they were. 
Oh, I'm sure they were thrilled to see you. <laughs> well, Robin looked like a deer caught in headlights. <laughs> and Patrick thought the whole thing was funny. Oh, I can see him getting action wherever he can, but her? <laughs> the secret life of Robin Scorpio. Hey, not just hearing anymore. <laughs> Are you sure you weren't mistaken? Because that new nurse, Allie, she kind of looks like Robin. Trust right? me, it was Robin. Oh, on the laundry cart. Pretty creative, huh? Oh, okay, but I, I, I swear I don't understand it. It's not even conducive. It's tall, there's edges, and there's one on top. You could get splinters Oh, I'm sure they managed to improvise. <laughs> <laughs> to improvisation. Yeah, improvisation. improvisation. <laughs> Ladies, is this a private party? Hey, hey, you miss me? <laughs> no, we didn't get a chance to get our schedule straight. Yeah, tomorrow night's fine. Elizabeth, where's meeting you this time? The name's Epiphany. If this is Lucky Spencer's, but you have a serious problem. You done with my phone? It wasn't Elizabeth this time, but there have been plenty of times before. Oh, you know that for a fact. You've been hitting on Elizabeth for weeks. <laughs> you just can't let this go, can you? I guess it's convenient when the husband's in the dark. Are you still in pain? I mean, is that what's brought on this raging paranoia? You always oh, this much of an ass. I have a low tolerance for anyone who tries to steal Elizabeth from me. Look, I'm not interested in your delusional suspicion. No, I've seen the two of you together. Doing what? Talking? You've been flirting with Elizabeth, grabbing every opportunity to be with her. Elizabeth is doing private nursing for me. She told you the truth. If you don't believe it, that's your fault. Our marriage will be fine as long as you stay the hell away from my wife. And give me a piece of advice. You are the one pushing Elizabeth away. Now, I may not be there to catch her when she falls, but somebody will. Let's just say that it's been, um, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> oh, you can join the club. <laughs> Have you ever had one of those days just seems like one long emotional roller coaster? I want to say between uh, working full time at the hospital, taking care of my toddler, <laughs> making time for my husband. No, I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> The key, ladies, is to make time for ourselves. Get a pedicure. Yeah, eat an entire pan of brownies. <laughs> yep. Throw our inhibitions to the wind and just get loose. <laughs> Salt and lime, please. Getting Whoa. loose is good. Especially if you're with the uh, right people. OK, Robin. Excuse me. I have a technical oh, question for you. Hey, drink up. Let's drink up. OK, so listen. I mean, I just wanted to know something. Hey, I'm going to ask you a little should question. Should we order some food? Yeah, maybe a plate of fries or something. Some OK, you know what I was trying I was trying to figure this out for myself. What? I'm just going to ask you. We okay. Just ask. Yeah. Wait, honey, Let's... honey, how do you do it on a laundry cart? Hey, you are cut off. Come on. What? Please. What? Yeah. What? We're all adults. I, just... <laughs> I want to know the mechanics. I want to know the mechanics. I can't believe you told them. You and Patrick Drake in an unlocked supply closet. <sighs> I thought you wanted people to know. It's not no. Kelly's fault. We had to drag it out of her. No, not true. I couldn't wait to tell them. I thought you'd want bragging rights. Oh, come on, Robin. We're happy for you. Oh, thank you. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> Why don't you just paint a big sign at the hospital that says, Robin Bings, Patrick, in supply closets? You probably just forgot to lock the door. <gasps> exactly. You got caught up in the heat of, you know, passion and all that. <laughs> OK, what they're trying to say is, what's Patrick like? All of you have thought about this, haven't you? Not really. Never. Sometimes you have to wonder. I mean, you know, with his reputation and all. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. I'll tell you. He so good. Oh. <laughs> he is, he is, he's like a, a, a stallion. 
He's a, he's a raw, untamed. I mean, I still can't even feel my toes. He <laughs> <laughs> about broke my hip. <laughs> I mean, every single time, I, I, can't, I can't get enough. I just want more. <laughs> more, please. <laughs> If you want more, Dr. Scorpio, you can have it any time. Hello, Dr. Drake. What a nice surprise. You want to join us? I would love to, but I am just here to pick up my date. You ready to go? Absolutely. Have a fun evening, ladies. Bye. We will. Hi. Hi. <laughs> it's a classy thing for him to do. He's a good person. Not to mention an untamed stallion. <laughs> mm, I'm <laughs> such a lucky girl. Man. At least there's one happy couple in Port Charles. Mm.